OpenAI is at the forefront of artificial intelligence, offering powerful tools like GPT models for creativity, productivity, and innovation. With a paid account, you unlock full access to advanced features, higher usage limits, and priority support, making it perfect for developers, researchers, and business looking to harness AI's full potential. Let's get started by setting up your paid account. First thing first, you need to open the openai.com. And then from the products menu, you need to click on API login. From there, you can sign in with your account or you can sign up for a new account. If you sign up, you can use your Google account, Microsoft account, or Apple account. I would go with my Google account. Now click on API. And then from the top right corner settings menu, you can open the billing side. And here, as you can see, I already canceled uh, the billing plan because I wanted to start a new one. So I start a billing plan and you can go with individual or company. And if you're individual, just click on the individual part. Here you need to fill your information for the card, billing address, and then when you're done, click on continue. Now you need to put your initial credit purchase that will be charged on your card to make sure you have enough credit to use. So I put $5 for example, and here it says would like to set up automatic recharge. If you like, you can enable it. I will disable it because I want just to make sure that uh, whenever I need, I will charge it again. So then I click on continue and then I confirm the payment. So my billing plan is activated now. Everything is set up and everything is ready to start working with OpenAI. So you can click on Playground, start using uh, the OpenAI feature here, or you can connect uh, through the API. If you're interested to use this API outside of OpenAI Playground, you need to create the API keys. In order to do that, go to the settings menu from the top, and then from the your profile, you need to go to the user API keys. Here you can create a new secret key, which you can use from outside to call the open API. Just name your key and then click on create secret key. Here we go. You get the secret key here. You need to save it somewhere safe and use it whenever you want to use the API. Hopefully you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. In the next videos, I'm going to show you how to use the OpenAI. Thank you.